Hey, what is up, everybody? It's your boy, Doc. It is March 11, 2009. It's Wednesday. Tomorrow, I'm real excited because I will be back in Philly. You know, it's been a minute since I've been there, actually since November. So, you know, I'm just going to be excited to see all my Philly people, you know, um, Germantown, North Philly, Northeast Philly, West Oak Lane, South Philly, Southwest Philly, Center City, of course, um, Gerard Avenue, um, it's just too many to name it. So shout out to everybody out in Philly. Uh, you know, I'm going to be out there tomorrow. The music conference is going down this weekend on uh, Sunday on uh, 12th, Mar- um, 12th and Market at the Marriott. My mind was going blank for a second. That's where I'm going to be at. Um, and I'm just be just chilling in Philly, you know, enjoying the rest of my spring break. But, um, yes, yeah, so, you know, I got these glasses on. I forgot about these already. But um, i about to snatch these off real quick. There you go, now, you can, now y'all can see me, you know, I'm on my whole spring break chill mode right now. But uh, if y'all don't know, though, I've been debating, for the past many videos, I've been talking about me getting a haircut, whether, you know, I should just play it safe with the regular dark fade all around, or should I get, you know, the mohawk, or the frohawk, you know. So, I decided to do that, and um, I've been wanting to get one for a minute. But I see how people had this, like, shaved, like, very, very shaved to the side and everything. So I wanted to do something different. I wanted to get the frohawk or mohawk, however you call it. But I wanted to get it with the dark fade so y'all see that. And you know my hair naturally curly already, so really good look. But, um, went ahead, got a haircut yesterday. Shout out to First Impressions. You know, if y'all in VA, North of VA, Hampton Road, 757 to be exact. If y'all out here, go to First Impressions, like, Shout out to James who cut my hair, by the way. And um, a little story about that. First impressions. I've been going there for like the past two, three years now because I've um, like my barber that I used to go to, he actually moved. So you know, it's like one of those things where you gotta find a new barber all again, and you know, it's one of those barbers you gotta find your trust with and everything. Those barbershops that you really trust like that. So you know, first impressions. I've been going there for a minute now. Um, well, and like even I was going there when I was living in Philly. You know, just Golden Combs, I went there in Philly, but at the same time, when I come back to VA, you know, there's times I'll hold out to get a haircut just to come here, you know, and get a haircut. So, you know, shout out to First Impressions. Um, they're usually on Virginia's Boulevard, but they're about to move to Janoff Shopping Center. They're going to be by the CC's and ABC store out in Janoff. So, you know, go look out for them, the best barbers. You know, they cut you real right, so, you know, you be looking real fresh, like me. <laughs> But that's what it is, so go check for, check out First Impressions. I'm going to plug them. And, um, what else? The cuts are like $15, so, I mean, normal price, really. And for a very, very quality cut. And, um, another thing. Um, updating the doc before every day. Y'all check that out. Um, Twitter, you know, be following me on Twitter. You know, shout out to all my followers up there. Um, please. I'm talking to you two crew, and everyone knows. Get a Twitter. It's very fun. You know, you can release all your business out there, whatever you want to call it. Um, It's like Facebook. You know how you update your status on Facebook or even MySpace, but, you know, MySpace status be a little whack. So, you know, I lean more towards Facebook. But it's just like Facebook, updating your status. But, you know, instead it's more convenient on Twitter, like, you can, you know, basically status anywhere, so, get with this Twitter, um, YouTube, of course, get me on YouTube, youtube.com slash dlcant10, because that's where y'all looking at it right now, um, myspace.com, myspace.com slash doc10, um, like I said, the one-year anniversary of the doc report is about to come up in May, so it's a lot of big things that's going to be coming up. Um, my birthday is April 2nd. Get me something if y'all want to. Send me birthday shout-outs or whatever. But April 2nd, I will be turning 19. Very excited about that. Um, let me see. Got to get a lot of things out there. Um, as far as this party, I said in the video that I was going to have a party in Philly. Um, that's not going to happen now because the place is actually booked the same day. So, um, you know, maybe another time I come up to Philly, I'll throw that party. But, you know, I was coining it. 
the quote unquote I might have a party party. So, you know, now it's it's Mike. The keyword was Mike, but you know, now it's not gonna happen. But we still gonna party regardless and fully whatever we are. So be on the lookout for that. Um, what else? Um, y'all gonna see me doing like updates, video updates from Philly. Why the phone got a ring now? What is it? Oh, that's my mom shaking her whole room. Um, wait one second. All right. Anyways, I'm back again. Here I am. But um, yeah, just basically um doing video updates from Philly. Um, being seeing my lavish hotel and also where I be in Philly, so y'all can you know get a better vibe with me. What else? Um. That's oh, I might be doing something from the radio. Um, not yeah, the radio music conference. Um, I may snatch an interview up with somebody. Y'all never know, so I'm gonna try and do my best to get some interviews, pull my connections, and do what it do. And we're gonna see how that turns out. You know, some doc exclusive, uh, doc report exclusives as always. So we're gonna try and pull something together. Um, another thing is, y'all see my room is chunky right now. Like, I'm giving y'all all of me right now. You know, I want y'all to feel more connected to me. Um. I took some of your advice, like Joe Work TV, shout out to you. Uh, he was telling me how my how I sounded like a little sleepy and all that. And because I was, like, dumb, busy, and mad sleepy a lot of the time, so a lot of times I didn't really come across how I usually do. You know, I'm more lively and all that, but I was coming very, like, dull and very, you know, very tired. Like, and because I was mad busy, projects left and right, doing my own work and other stuff, so, you know, it's kind of like pulling me down. I was really, you know, very tired, but now I'm back full focus, energy, all that good stuff, so, you know, now I'm alive, so shout out to Joe Roy TV. Also, um, a new camera is in the process. This is the camera that I usually use, but it's been taking a while to get it uploaded on YouTube, so I stopped using it, and I started using my cell phone, but now... I'm about to start using the camera again. I might get another camera this weekend while I'm in Philly. We're going to see how that turns out. Um, and that's the my room is like mad junkie. Y'all can really tell my room is in like transition right now. Like I'm really trying to get everything situated in my room. I'm trying to change it around, do some hot stuff with it. So, you know, y'all going to be on the lookout for that. The haircut, I'm loving it though. So shout out to First Impressions, like I said. Shout out to Philly215. Shout out to all my viewers. Shout out to all my people that... Um, down friends with, <laughs> I guess. And, um, so yeah, that's what it is. That's the end of this video. I'm going to do another video, probably talk about some stuff real quick. But um, in the meantime, check this one out, view it, rate it, all that good stuff. Check out the doc report. Hit me up on MySpace, Twitter.com/slash Mr. Doc, and see y'all in Philly.